We're going to discuss how to give lidocaine for a paracentesis. A lot of different ways that you can do this. Uh, for this particular video, we're going to presume that we've already scanned, we've measured how deep we need to go, um, and that we, uh, you know, that we have made a skin wheel, a dermatotomy, we've kind of numbed the skin, and that we're ready to go basically um, into the collection. So one thing to keep in mind for this video is we're not going to use ultrasound because we've kind of done that beforehand, and we're going to actually hook up the UE needle to the lidocaine syringe, so we're gonna do it all in one. We're gonna give lidocaine deeper with the UE needle, and then once we get into the collection, we're gonna feed the catheter off and start draining. So, um, for the purposes of uh, this video, we just want to be mindful about how we're going to be holding things. Basically, you know, we want to use one hand to stabilize. We have a free hand because we're not doing it under ultrasound guidance. And then we're going to be giving lidocaine and, and um, also aspirating with the syringe. We just want to be careful about how we're holding our hands so we can do both things easily. So, uh, I'm going to hold it in this orientation where I'll give lidocaine and then I'll aspirate here like so, you know, with my thumb and um, index finger. I'm going to use my other hand to just kind of stabilize uh, the UE needle. So, you know, I can kind of stabilize here um, or like this, however you feel more comfortable. We can do it like this because then we're in position to take the catheter off. Um, and we're going to go where we've kind of marked before, where we know we need to go. And then we're just going to go in and start giving lidocaine as we go and then we're gonna go a little bit deeper, and then we'll start aspirating, and then here we see we've already hit into the ascites collection right there, we're aspirating back ascites. So what we're going to do is just keep our hand very, very steady here, okay, and just feed off the catheter. We're not moving the needle, the catheter is the only thing that's going forward. And then once we've hubbed the catheter, what we can do is take this out, uh, bury our sharps here, and then we'll hook up to our syringe here, and then we can pull back our ascites and take whatever we need um, to send for analysis. And then if we're gonna be doing a large volume paracentesis, actually what we can do as well too, is we can hook up our, um, our tubing uh, and our uh, vacuum containers to take off more ascites. But basically, this is a very uh, simple way to kind of give lidocaine, and then once you get into the collection, um, actually start, um, you know, draining using just the UE needle. So you can kind of do both together.